Welcome back to part 5, this is Austin Narebi, and we're playing Sonic... We're talking over Sonic 06, and this is Wacky Workbench. Uh, no, it's Sonic! I said Sonic 06! Fuck me, I said Sonic 06 again. This is Sonic CD, and this is Wacky Workbench. I, f I did it again. I fucking did it again. I called this freaking game Sonic 06. Sonic CD. Sonic CD. I keep waking my cat up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I keep accidentally calling this game Sonic 06. It's Sonic C. It's similar names! Sonic this, this, Sonic that, that. They're similar names! But two completely different games because this one is actually tolerable. Huh? Actually, um. Sonic 06 came out when I was in kindergarten and I played that shit so much. And now it's like that, I'm just like, why did I like this game? <laughs> oh, Son Sonic 06 is just awful. It was actually, um, quite quick for me to get control of, but some of the levels were so shitty that I could not figure it out. Like, I got so far in the game, I was so close to being it, but then I was just like, you know what, fuck this, fuck this, I can't figure out how to get through this one fucking lava level, fuck you, I'm going to bed. Yeah, I hated the, like, where you run into the volcano. Yeah, I, I think I... I think I gave up at the part where you were playing as Shadow. Uh, I, uh, I, I wasted a whole summer on that game. I knew it was bad before I bought it. I knew it was bad, but I just wanted it because I wanted to experience how bad it was. I think I was like four or five when I played it, and I would play that so much after I finished my homework. I was like, oh yeah, oh yeah, down play some Sanic! <laughs> Sanic the Hedgehog. <laughs> And I was like so pumped plays a damn Sanic. And like I had the biggest crush on Sanic, but it wasn't to the point like how some people are today, like a Kai Dahlia. Like she just no. No. Bitch no. Yeah, so I've gotten the good future in all the zones now, so every time you go into the future it's nice and pretty. Hello. In Wacky Workbench, there's one area where you can find, like, a statue or whatever, and I've never been, I've never, whenever I'm here, I, re I forget to, uh, check it out or look for it. But there's, like, a statue, like, behind where you start in one of the, one of the levels here. Um, on the subject of Easter eggs, um, I don't remember exactly what it was, but, actually, I don't even remember, I don't even remember if this is right or not, but... I'll try and remember it the best I can, because it's been a while. There's actually, like, one time where I was playing Tomb Raider Legend, and... I actually thought this was an easter egg, because I had never... Because my quest was to unlock every single goddamn map in that game, which I have on several occasions, uh, and get every single achievement on it, which is actually very easy now, unfortunately, because I've mastered that game. <laughs> um... <laughs> And it's actually really easy, um, and I could actually beat it in one day if I don't take any breaks. I've, uh, I have GTA 4 and I haven't beaten it yet. I've unlocked all the islands, but I haven't beaten GTA 4. I kind of got tired with it. Mm -hmm. I picked, I picked up GTA 5 because I wanted to play that one because of Achievement Hunter Michael, and all that. Michael, Michael's my favorite. Oh, you're talking about the, the character. You're not talking about Michael from Achievement Hunter. You're talking about Michael from GTA V. Actually, they both are my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, lo I love Rage Quit. Rage Quit is amazing. It's so like, do, 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 do. you know, at the very beginning, it's like dun, on the dun, piano. Dun, 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 dun. Fuck! He did. He he played the game that was like Rage Quit Squared or something like that, and it was freaking hilarious. That like he was trying to get the little cube through the little obstacle courses, and if you touch something, it's and there's like a failure counter at the top. He's like, "You fat fuck! You fat purple fuck! You fat fuck! You fat purple fuck!" I've got. I've actually gotten that mad playing video games. It's it's not really a stretch. I mean, uh, he plays it up for the camera, but I've actually gotten that mad playing video games before. One time I played a game called Flappy Fedora. My dad was home, and my computer was actually still working at the time. I played it 
with a mouse, obviously, and all my dad could hear was me screaming, You goddamn cock-sucking son of a bitch, I will murder you and your fucking family! <laughs> I want my dad again. You look looks so dumb, my shit, she's like, Rabbi, please, shut up, let me sleep. Ah, this drive... ah. Yeah, so basically, he gets stuck in the ceiling here with his uh, drill robot. My God, shit! Fuck. And and then it, he, it explodes, and then there is a huge explosion, and uh, he es he escapes like a boss. Bye, bitch. And this is the end of. Part 5, and uh, me and Ruby will see you next part. Sonic Boom! Sonic Boom! Sonic Boom! Okay, that was the end of Part 5. So, um, Part 6? Yeah. Okie dokie. <laughs> I'm gonna say Sonic Boom is horrible this time, but I actually was looking forward to it.